happy Saturday everyone. You might notice that my hair is a lot darker than the last time that you saw me and that's because I had it colored. I've gone to the dark side again. This was done at Rock Ebony in South Melbourne. I recently tried them out for a haircut and a color. Really happy with how it's sitting. I love it so much. So yeah, it's like taking a while to get used to because when you first get your hair done, it's always like a bit of a shock until you get used to it. So I'm really happy with it though. And I just wanted to check in with you guys. I'm having a day off today, so I thought I would keep filming what I get up to and basically this morning I went for a run at the gym in my building which was really good. I'm feeling very like refreshed and energized because of that. I try to do as many you know gym sessions as I can in a week because I find that it helps me a lot now that I'm working just with like maintaining you know my mind my body and my soul like it's just something that's so good for me on so many levels. It's great for stress as well. And then I went and got my nails done in Middle Park. I went for this lovely neutral color called Bubble Bath, which I'm really happy with. So that's been my morning. It's been quite busy and now it's already like one o'clock. So I feel like the day has just flown by. Mum is coming into the city to catch up with me. So we're going to grab a coffee, which I need. I mean, I haven't had a coffee yet today, so I'm having withdrawal symptoms. But before I head off, I thought I'd show you my OOTD. So today I'm wearing this Cook Eye ribbed white t-shirt with my Forever New pretty pleated skirt. And then I've got my Gucci sneakers on, which are just so comfy. I was going to wear my heels, my sandals, um, like my heeled sandals, but I thought, you know what? Let's be comfy. It's my day off today, so let's just, you know, wear sneakers. Why not? So I'm here at Arba in the Crown Towers foyer. It's very low key but luxe here. It's so lovely. Coffees have arrived, so I'm getting in the beautiful smell of coffee that I need. I honestly am dying for this. But after this, mum and I are planning on going for a walk into the city. We might do a bit of shopping, so I'll keep you posted. But I'm hoping to find a few more key pieces for my work wardrobe. We'll soon see though, I can't make any promises. Anyway, cheers, most important time of the day. <laughs> Just got a smoothie from Laneway Greens. Looks so good. What's the verdict on the smoothie, Mum? Delicious. And we're just window shopping at Baird Footwear. So good. I'm so happy with the smoothie. Well <laughs> worth it. So I'm just at the Emporium now and I'm having a bit of a shop around. I'm looking for some workwear, but I'm not having much luck to be honest. So We'll soon see, but I think I'm also going to stop into Mecca, which is actually just down there. And I might see if I can get like a lip gloss or some kind of beauty item. I feel like I just need to add to my kit. And also like, you know what? I don't work hard for nothing. I need to treat myself today. So I'm going home with something. I just don't know what yet. and I thought I'd show you guys what I bought in the city today because I did have quite a productive shopping day. So starting with some key items that I got from Cook Eye. Now this top is going to be a staple in my wardrobe, especially as we transition from summer to autumn. I feel like it's just one of those pieces that you need under you know, a cardigan, a blazer, a jumper, or if it's really hot, you can just wear it by itself. And this is a white ribbed singlet top. 
Now the straps are great, it's workwear appropriate and I just think I'm going to get so much wear out of it. And what I love about Kukai and their kind of, you know, basic tops, they're really well priced for the quality that they are and they wash really well. I'm wearing one right now and it washes so good, especially white. I feel like sometimes that can be totally hit and miss, like a white tee or a white singlet. Sometimes you wash them and they just aren't as white anymore. So this honestly has lasted really well and I feel like this will do the same. So that is the first piece that I bought. Then I got a blazer because I'm working now. I feel like I want a really just a really like loose fitting blazer. So obviously you want a blazer to like fit you and be structured, but I want something that's not too constricting. And I do have blazers, but at the moment they're just a bit too constricting and tight and just not comfortable to wear. And comfort is the, the key when it comes to buying clothes because otherwise you just won't wear them. They'll sit there and you know, you'll always think, oh, I forgot I had that because you just don't wanna wear it. So this one is very comfortable. It is a pink blazer as well. You guys know I love pink. It's my favorite color. And this is just stunning on. I can't wait to wear it and to show you guys in a video or on Instagram very soon. The buttons are quite nice as well. I feel like that is where a lot of people go wrong with blazers. I was having a look in the city today at all different stores, high end and also just like mid range places. And sometimes you'd see like a great blazer, but the buttons were just strange. Like, you know, there was this really lovely tweed blazer that I saw with the most bizarre buttons and I thought, you know, it's just not classic. Like you want a classic piece. So this one, the buttons are just simple, plain, which is what I wanted. And the color is gorgeous. I'm trying to introduce more light, neutral and soft colors to balance out with my hair at the moment. So I feel like that is a key piece. And then I also got this beautiful necklace that my mum bought for me while we were at Kukai and it has stars on it. You guys know I love stars, anything star related. It's just my favorite, so it's my favorite shape. So yeah, I got this really dainty star necklace. I will try it on soon and show you guys so you can see it up close, but basically it's one of those really like choker style necklaces, very dainty, very small stars, and I just feel like it's so pretty. So thank you, mum. That's a little haul for today and a bit of an update on what I got up to. I'm going to have a rest now because I feel like I have walked all over Melbourne. So it's time to have a bit of a lie down and I'll check back in with you guys soon. I'm just about to head out for dinner with my family. I thought I'd quickly show you my OOTN or outfit of the night. I've got this blouse on from Claudie Piello, which I'm obsessed with. It has all of these Parisian landmarks like the Louvre, the Arc de Triomphe, and it's just so beautiful. I've also got this Kukai necklace that mum bought me today, as well as my page denim jeans, Chanel handbag, and Nine West shoes. That's my look for tonight. Now let's go get some food because I'm hungry. It's like 8.30 and I haven't eaten dinner yet. So hungry, so let's go. I just got to the Atlantic and we've ordered our meals for the night. I can't wait. I ordered the barramundi, so stay tuned. And yeah, I'm here with mum as well. Hi. So yeah, we're having a little bit of a family dinner, which is quite lovely. It's good to catch up. And I know sometimes I'm bringing you down But I always make you smile, don't I? We're like the waves on a big blue storm, you see just turning down the TV because I am watching Max Married at First Sight in bed and it's actually a few days later guys. It's no longer Saturday. I think that was when I filmed this. So it's actually, what day is it? It's Tuesday, Tuesday already. And I've been busy working. I'm just watching TV in my pajamas, fresh faced. And I thought I would sign off this video here, but I will be filming more very, very soon. So stay tuned. 
Thank you for watching this vlog though. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up. Click that subscribe button. Come and join the Frenchie fam. I'd love to have you on board and I'm sure I'll see you in my next video very, very soon. By the way, guys, leave a comment below. Do you want me to start a new vlogging series? Like maybe a weekly vlog series, something that incorporates work. Let me know what you think. I'd love to hear from you and yeah, I'll speak to you guys very soon. Have an amazing day because you deserve it. Bye for now. See ya. Still you're the one who brings out the best in me